In the upcoming videos, we are going to study factors affecting organizational learning. Well, now this may be a bit, uh, you know, overwhelming. Why are we studying organizational learning when it comes to the organizational change? Well, the reason is that when it comes to the organizational change, organizations have to learn at first in order uh, to change in an appropriate manner. So that's why organizational learning. And I find it most appropriate uh, or, or the most appropriate part from organizational learning to study the factors that are affecting it. And they are going to affect it in a negative way. So we have to be aware of these factors. But before we start with this topic, it is necessary to learn two concepts. There is a manager's cognitive structure and then there are these cognitive biases. And these cognitive biases are going to be the factors that are affecting the organizational uh, learning and they are going to do so in a negative way. So negative way. But let's start with this term manager's cognitive structure. This is the system of interrelated beliefs, preferences, expectations and values a person uses to define problems and events. So you, you really can imagine that managers are having this sort of cognitive structure. It's, it's your mind. It, it's what, what is in there and what is influencing your decision making and your your learning so let me uh, let me add this learning so it's influencing so maybe you have some some specific beliefs maybe you believe uh, that some products are better than the others that some suppliers are better or worse than the others that is the basic idea of a cognitive structure now let's see the the other term which is maybe more important cognitive biases these are factors that systematically bias cognitive structures that we have just talked about so that bias cognitive structures and affect organizational learning and decision making so i hope you can see it now these cognitive biases that that we have a definition right over here are listed here around so we have these cognitive biases we right now have one two three four five and they are influencing or that they are biasing so that they bias the manager's cognitive structure in a negative way of course and that is going to influence the decision making and learning and of course the organizational change itself so in the upcoming videos we are going to study cognitive dissonance projection and ego defensiveness escalation of commitment frequency and representativeness and illusion of control so that we see what can bias a manager's mind and and then influence this decision making learning and of course organizational change 